Manchester United manager Eric Ten Hag insists he will form his own opinion on a proposed new European Super League should it ever materialise. European development company A22 Sports Management is promoting a revamped Super League after it crashed and burned within 48 hours of its launch in April 2021. The venture was trumpeted by United co-chairman Joel Glazer but the club's supporters protested vociferously against it and forced the postponement of the home Premier League fixture against Liverpool on May 2, 2021. A22 chief executive Bernd Reichert claimed the foundations of European football are in danger of collapsing, however the proposal is likely to be met with short shrift by supporters of English clubs. When the revamped proposal was raised at Ten Hag's pre-match press conference on Thursday, he said, I am aware of the dynamic of what's going on in sections but if I see they're coming up with new ideas I have to have a look at it and I will make an opinion. So I am not aware because we are playing so many games in this moment. We have to develop this team, we have some problems with new players to bring in, so that's where my focus point is, therefore I need all my energy. About new European competitions, other people at the club will have a look at it and inform me if the time is there and we have to make decisions. But the decision is up to the club. I think the current structure is good but there will always be initiatives to make it better, to make the football better and that is what life is, people always want to construct better, which is a good thing because if it is in favor of the football, it is always good. The original plan for the Super League consisted of 12 founding member clubs in a 20-team league. United, Liverpool, Arsenal, Tottenham, Chelsea, Manchester City, Juventus, Inter Milan, AC Milan, Barcelona, Real Madrid and Atletico Madrid initially joined as founding members before an intense backlash.